Hello everybody, welcome to Minutes with PJ. Today's day is September 27, 2016. Our word for discussion is husbandman. Jeremiah 51, 23, I will also break in pieces with thee, the shepherd and his flock, and with thee will I break in pieces the husbandman and his yoke of oxen, and with thee will I break in pieces captains and rulers. Amos 5.16, Therefore the Lord, the God of hosts, the Lord said thus, Wailing shall be in all the streets, and they shall say in all the highways, Alas, alas, and they shall call the husbandmen to mourning, and such as are skillful of the lamentation of wailing. In John 15.1, I am the true vine, and my father is the husbandman. And to Timothy, to six, the husbandmen that labored must be first partaker of the fruits. In James 5, 7, Be patient, therefore, brethren, unto the coming of the Lord. Behold, the husbandman waited for the precious fruit of the earth, and hath long patience for it, until he received the early and later rain. Define this is a householder, master of the house. Um, it's also a farmer, a tiller of soil, a person that cultivates the land. Jeremiah knew that being the head of a household or husbandman was very important. They had complete control of their flock, slaves, and house. Jesus explained that he was divine and that God was the husbandman. The husbandman who does the labor will partake of his fruits. God is the husbandman of our lives, who is patient and will be there when we believe and live for him. Once you think about this today, have a blessing.